Hello my darlings, I hope you're doing great. So today I was actually tagged by one of my YouTube friends. I will link her channel down below. Uh, you absolutely have to check her out. I was tagged a while, a while, a while ago uh, to do heavy hitters kind of video. And I have done such video before, I think a year ago or so, but these videos are really fun to make because this is also a great update of my collection to show you what is currently the strongest fragrance. Uh, I definitely do have way over 10. I'm not sure if it was supposed to be 10, but you know how I roll. I never do the exact number that I tell you that I'm gonna do. So let's just roll with it okay i don't even know how many fragrances i have on this list but there's many uh, and i think you're gonna like them because they're very good and very very potent so before we jump right in into the fragrances i want to give a quick shout out and welcome our sponsor to the channel lily silk so if you guys follow me for a while you know i have worked with lily silk for almost two years guys can you believe it okay maybe not exactly two years but it's been way over a year and a half which is absolutely amazing and i'm super super happy that um you know my channel is able to have those long-term partnerships and uh, thanks to that i am able to give you that guys discount whenever i can that that is just amazing and i'm super super grateful so this portion of the video is sponsored by lily silk as i said if you do not know lily silk already this is a fashion brand that's specializes in silk pieces but they do also have cashmere knits etc etc they also do uh, bedding made of silk sheets and gorgeous pieces of clothing everything is 100% silk so it has many health benefits I really recommend you check it out but guys I just want to tell you straight away I don't want to ramble too much about how great silk is they are currently having a massive massive of specials on their website before Christmas so please go ahead check it out because there are so many discounts so many great pieces that you can purchase in this time of the year uh, this is also gonna make a gorgeous gift for your loved ones or for yourself because they are packed in those beautiful packagings uh, I really really love how they come uh, they look super luxurious and of course the pieces itself are extremely luxurious as they feel so such a great quality guys this is absolutely amazing and I am actually currently wearing their newest spotlight collection and this is a it might seem like a completely normal shirt but it's not let me get closer to you so if you haven't noticed these are rhinestones and they go all the way around the sleeves and right till the bottom of the shirt so this is how it looks like isn't that crazy I absolutely love it this particular shirt comes in black the one that I have and white like off-white which I also really really want uh, and also there's another collection which I'm gonna show you right in a second this is more like a elegant homeware collection so you have some cashmere knits you also have beautiful blouses it looks extremely elegant i think they're both gonna make such great statement pieces during the holiday season you can just throw on such shirt basically with anything and you're gonna look so put together and so elegant and like this you know rich gorgeous elegant lady that I love being perceived as I'm not gonna lie so uh, this is just straight up my alley and I know you guys absolutely love Lily Silk just as much as I do this is just this to me this shirt gives me such YSL vibes Saint Laurent vibes it is insane even the color it's not your typical color it goes a little bit rounded right here so it just looks so cool and so on trend at the moment all right guys the next piece that i want to show you is actually on the hanger because there's only one of me but i will insert a clip where you can see me wearing the piece and that is 
another blouse from the newest collection and as you can see it has absolutely insane color so so beautiful and I love the puffy sleeves you know that I'm all for some drama in the sleeves and the bottom of the sleeves looks like this and it also has pearls as you can see so 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 beautiful and as you can see this particular silk is quite shiny so it looks even more luxurious of course those pieces are non-see-through so no undergarments are going to be shown through the shirts or any other pieces of clothing and i have so many pieces from lily silk and they're always perfect perfect quality so yes this is the other one i absolutely love it i think it's going to be perfect even with normal jeans and you know just a jean jacket in spring and now with maybe a fun coat or something and they both actually gonna match my handbags perfectly so i really really love the color scheme that the new collections have they look very very on trend to me especially this one which is so Saint Laurent to me and the, the trim, amazing. So yes, I love them both. This one is so pretty. This one comes also in white and in black, if I'm not mistaken, and I think also in pink. And this one also comes in white, as I said. So check them out, guys. I think you definitely should hurry up because currently Lily Silk has so many specials on their website and there's also my discount code that you can and should use. So I would really not waste your time before Christmas and get those pieces as soon as you can because they might not be available anymore because I know there is a very high demand on those pieces, especially the newest collection because as you can see, it is just divine, just divine and so elegant and this silk actually looks very, very nice on your body. It hugs it perfectly in the places that it should hug and keeps it loose where it should be a little bit looser, uh, but I would still suggest going size up. As I always do, I go at least one size up in all my silk pieces. So yes, guys, beautiful pieces, highly recommend. Uh, my discount and the links to them will be linked below in the description box. So don't forget to check it out. And now we can get into the perfume. All right, guys, are you now ready for the fragrances? My heavy hitters, my super strong fragrances that leave a massive trail that are long lasting, basically, they suffocate everybody and anybody that comes close to you. All right, if you want that, there you have it. So guys, I'm not gonna get too much into the fragrances because you all know them. Uh, they have been on my channel. I have already reviewed them. So if you want a specific review of a fragrance, just browse through my channel and you'll surely find it. So now I'm just gonna, you know, breeze through them. I don't wanna ramble too much. So the first one that is definitely a heavy hitter is Velvet Vanilla from Mancera. And this might come as a surprise to you because it is a bubblegum tuberose, very sweet fragrance, but let me tell you, this is such a heavy hitter. It's insane. Super, super heavy in your face fragrance great sillage and longevity you will be noticed it's very feminine definitely not masculine like in the slightest uh, but it's lovely uh, if you want something even stronger even sweeter than uh, Givenchy uh, L'Antardi or My Way Intense I would say it's even more intense than My Way Intense if it makes sense I'm even rhyming cool all right guys so that is velvet vanilla if you love tuberose mixed with very strong vanilla and sugary notes you will probably adore it all right next one is a more of a summery fragrance i don't ever wear it during winter but this is definitely one of the strongest fragrances in my collection and that is jasmine whisk by rosazi and this is amber vanilla tonka coconut fruity fragrance uh, it is very similar to kirke by tiziana terenzi but i would say it leans more middle eastern you definitely get that middle eastern touch that amber you know it's very like <laughs> very middle eastern okay it's 
very sweet and very fruity though and mainly you get that passion fruit mixed with the coconut and amber very very nice one but just so you know it is strong like strong 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 so yes it surely has been featured in my previous heavy hitter video or something like that I don't want to repeat myself but I'm just gonna quickly mention it because it really is very heavy so yes guys I highly highly recommend it okay next we have Amouage Blossom Love uh, I have two Amouage fragrances and a lot of decans of others and I must say this one is definitely one of the heaviest along with Crimson Rocks and of course all those you know interlude women and those super super heavy that I cannot even wear so if you want a heavy hitter I think Amouage is a good brand overall to go for but if you are similar in taste as me I think the one that you will like from Amouage because let me tell you they are quite difficult uh, is definitely Blossom Love there's also Love Tuberose but I wouldn't say it's as heavy as this one uh, this one is a little bit like cherry, a little bit amaretto, vanillic fragrance, very sweet. It has some suede to it, but I really don't get it that much, to be completely honest. I mostly get um, almond blossom, cherry blossom. It's an, a lot of amaretto. It's just a very, very sweet fragrance, uh, very rosy as well. There's also rose to it uh, that gives this fragrance that, you know, Middle Eastern touch again. Uh, but if you love sweet fragrances, sweet jammy roses, if you like amaretto, you're gonna love it. So that is Amouage Blossom Love. Then we have an oldie but a goodie and that is Dior Addict and this is one of very few fragrances that actually has great lasting power till this day even though it's been reformulated thousands of times this is still a heavy hitter this I have to tell you very very heavy fragrance powdery vanilla white florals this is a bomb you know this is really in your face but it's sexy feminine and cozy at the same time this is definitely something i love wearing in winter i think i might actually wear it during christmas who knows i might do it i might do it i really do like it to me it's on the mature side i wouldn't say a very young girl is gonna feel good in it because i didn't when i was younger so keep that in mind but if you are like you know 25 plus you might get into it and really enjoy it so yes your addict fantastic all right next uh, we have uh, Dior private range Maison Christian Dior and I only have one bottle even though I tested many fragrances and I must say um, they are all quite decent with lasting power but they definitely do differ when it comes to projection and the one that really stood out to me and that is the reason I only have this one because it just blew my mind in comparison to others sillage if you know what i mean like this one was absolutely unbeatable i was testing pretty much all the fragrances in the boutique that day i tested ambre nuit spice bread spice blend um oud rosewood you know so so many and this one was the strongest the strongest and as soon as i smelled this one i couldn't smell anything else that's why i got it and that is christian dior saint -Al noir to me this is the most beautiful sandalwood fragrance ever this is pretty much sandalwood ambrette slightly rose but not too much uh, amber ambrette and uh, sandalwood that's mainly what you get a beautiful dry very woody sandalwood base not too milky at all it's more like you know this instancy burnt sandalwood it's kind of like you would burn an incense and uh, ambrette, which actually makes this fragrance feel slightly fruity. I personally love ambrette. Uh, if you don't know, even 
Ariana Grande new fragrance "Got Is a Woman" has umbret to it, so you know you can expect um, that in here as well. Amazing, just amazing. And as a side note, if you do have "God Is a Woman" from Ariana Grande, uh, they will pair beautifully together. If you want that super strong fragrance, but you still wanna have "God Is a Woman" on your on your skin. Yeah, these two are gonna be a match made in heaven. So Santal Noir, super, super strong fragrance. This one is definitely the strongest from the whole range of Christian Dior so far. Toba Color is also very, very strong, but I still think that this one is slightly more in your face. Very, very strong one, but super beautiful uh, many people consider this one like real customers not um you know perfume reviewers on youtube real customers do consider this one the best out of the whole range so it has to make sense right saint Noir. i'm gonna shut up next if you like lira from zerjov you will pr probably like this even more because it's stronger and that is Ex Idolo Love and Crime. Uh, this is fantastic. I wish I had more than just 30 ml, but you know, considering how many fragrances I have, I probably should not complain. Uh, this is basically like Lyra, even more on that orangey side, uh, more spicy. And then you get that same vanilla that you have in Lyra. It's caramelly, actually very caramelly super sweet super strong i did wear it the other day when i was buying dumplings for christmas you know because i'm trying to uh, lift the weight off my mom's shoulders so i decided i'm gonna get um main <laughs> the main dishes catered for us so i was buying the dumplings and the woman in the dumpling store uh, was absolutely overwhelmed with this one. And till this day, I'm not sure if what she said was a compliment or not, because what she said was, oh my God, your fragrance is so strong. And I was like, mm. so I'm not sure if she liked it or not. I don't care what matters. You could smell it, right? You could smell it. So. Ex Idolo, Love and Crime, again, very, very similar to Lira by Zerzhov, but I think it's better and stronger. So yes, there you have it. Next, 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 uh, something ambery. And this, unfortunately, is the old formulation, but it really is strong, guys. It's a beautiful heavy hitter, so I did want to quickly mention it. And that is Olympia Intense. I think if you still get um, the current version and really overspray heavily, you might get the same effect as you would get with five sprays of this. But, you know, I just had to mention it. So I'm very, very sorry to annoy you but the old formulation of olympia intense is just to die for this is a very sweet almost gourmand amber fragrance vanilla amber and some salt that's it there's nothing much more here love it okay next what do we have next um mikalev glamour i absolutely love this fragrance this reminds me of the old formulation of alien but add to it some vanilla and plum that's that's what you get in glamour the old alien with plum and vanilla absolutely gorgeous definitely one of the best creations currently on the market N niche designer doesn't matter is just the best overall uh, fantastic i know the price is quite hefty but trust me if you love the original alien it's gonna be more than worth it for you because you're gonna finally get what you have been craving since it was reformulated 
because it basically ended my searches for the old bottle of Alien by Mugler. So, and in my opinion, it's actually even better because it has vanilla and I love vanilla, so it's sweeter. So yes, uh, I absolutely adore it. The bottle is fantastic. Maybe not too travel friendly, but it's still gorgeous. So that is Mikalev Glamour. Definitely a heavy, heavy hitter. Okay, uh, let's go with some Montal. And when it comes to Montal, um, maybe not all of them, but majority of them are heavy. They have great projection, great lasting power and great sillage. And to me, this one I think is the best. If not one of the best is the best. And that is Arabian Stonka. I cannot get enough of this fragrance. It's absolutely stunning. I see it more and more available online. So go check it out. Links will be below as usual, along with my discount code for Lily Silk, just saying. Um, with Arabian Stonka, it really matches my outfit and the vibe. Um, it's so good. This is uh, sugary oud with some rose, but not too much. It's more about that sugar and tonka and vanilla, you know. Slightly like Baccarat Rouge with that saffron, but it's just beautiful. It's definitely sweeter and denser, so yeah, love it. Definitely my favorite from my whole collection. Uh, another one that's slightly similar, I'm saying slightly, okay, and that is actually a dupe of Inicio Parfum Privé um, Oud for Greatness. This one is called Oud for Glory. And this one is from Latafa. So, you know, the Middle Eastern brand that makes dupes, basically. Inspired versions. But I must say, this one is extremely similar. Uh, I would say Oud for Greatness from Inicio has more nutmeg and this one has more patchouli to my nose. I'm not sure if it's like that to other people, but to my nose. And this one has more patchouli, uh, but it's actually a very wearable patchouli. It's definitely a strong, deep fragrance. Uh, definitely leans masculine, in my opinion. Uh, to me, Arabian Stonka is very feminine and this one is very masculine. I love when my boyfriend wears it. Smells absolutely beautiful on him. Very, very sexy. Uh, it's definitely a compliment getter. So if you love your heavy hitters, this one is for you and the price is very low. So go check it out if you are okay with having a dupe. Of course, I did buy it um, for reviewing purposes, but it turned out to be actually really, really good and my boyfriend loves it. So the bottle ain't bad either. I love it. Very, very nice one. Okay, speaking of Inicio and here I have the original Inicio. And again, with the brand, you could pick any and it will be a heavy hitter. If you go for rehab, uh, addictive vibration, absolute aphrodisiac, side effect, no matter what you get, it will be a heavy hitter. But uh, the one that I absolutely love and cannot get enough of is Atomic Rose. You guys recommended me this fragrance for so long and I finally have it. Just amazing. It is very similar to the Lina from Marley. Um, but it's way deeper, more Middle Eastern. Uh, to me, it's more like slightly creamy, spicy almost. Uh, it also has Hedion, which is a, I don't wanna butcher it, but basically it is like a version of Jasmine, type of ja Jasmine, which is a great aphrodisiac. And it really does uh, trigger your sensuality so that's very nice um, and yeah it has some amber and vanilla very very good fragrance in general if you love roses you're gonna adore this to me this is one of the best roses that i own and the bottle is to die for i absolutely love inicio bottles i know not everybody loves them but i do so that is inicio atomic rose and as i said the whole brand 
they are all heavy hitters and very sexy fragrances so I love that okay we have four more fragrances to go are you okay with that are you ready my darlings so the next one I will go with Navitus Parfum Soir Exclusive and again with Navitus maybe not all of them but vast majority are heavy hitters are very very heavy fragrances that will last you forever but this one is definitely one of the heaviest and that is Soir Exclusive and this one is glorious this is coffee marshmallow slightly floral slightly boozy but not too much super duper sexy guys super duper sexy it's sweet it's just oh, i cannot even explain how gorgeous this is definitely one of the best creations from navitus along with the embrace and arcanum and imperial this one is another one that i absolutely love um great 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 longevity like with all of these fragrances that i'm showing you today so if you want something super sweet super sexy super loud i think swa exclusive will be for you especially if you love those marshmallowy touches with slight um, touches of coffee you're gonna love it it's so yummy so gourmand beautiful fragrance and i still do have an active discount code for navitus so go check it out guys everything you need will be below so that is soi exclusive next one we have scandal by night from jean paul gautier and this one is the darker sweeter denser heavier sister of the original and i love it actually i'm gonna spray it on my fake hair why not Mm, this is basically the original scandal so you have that patchouli deep honey base but you have cherry you have tuberose it's so much sweeter and denser it's insane i personally love it because i love those heavy gluey almost fragrances and this one is perfect for winter for parties uh, this one is a perfect New Year's Eve scent actually uh, so please let me know if you want to see New Year's Eve fragrances because I'll be happy to do such video it, it might be fun um, so yes guys this one is great it has better performance than the original in my opinion uh, I might be wrong because it you know it does differ on every skin uh, I know this one lasts better on me than the original uh, so the projection is fantastic the longevity is great as well on this I love it I don't like the bottle I must be honest I really hate it you cannot grab it by the cap and it just screams grab me by those legs right like it would be perfect to just grab it like that but in a second it will just slide down so be careful with that because it's tempting to just grab those legs i'm telling you it's tempting uh, and the bottle is very very heavy i think it would be good to use less glass and make it just a little bit lighter but these are just my rambles and thoughts this one is good scent wise so there you have it and two last fragrances from one and the same brand guys i know i'm very boring but since we are doing heavy hitters they have to be here um, i'm not sure if i did feature them in the last video like this but i decided you know what since i don't even know how many fragrances i'm showing you in this video i'm gonna show them so both from Kurjan, of course we have Baccarat Rouge and the other one is of course my baby Oud Satin Mood. Uh, another one that is a great um, New Year's Eve fragrance, however, I know I'm not going to use it because I am going uh, alone on a New Year's Eve getaway with my boyfriend and we will be attending New Year's Eve ball and I know I'm not gonna wear it because my boyfriend doesn't really love it so you know what's the point I want to be smacking hot for him and to him it smells like plastic so I think I'm just gonna skip on that even though it's my favorite fragrance I highly recommend it still 
Uh, this is super duper beautiful vanilla oud and rose combination uh, slightly powdery but not too much to me rose in here is more in the background you mainly get that beautiful woody touch and the vanilla and benzoin and some violet but not too much as well so so beautiful fantastic fragrance for evenings for dates of course if someone doesn't tell you that it smells like plastic but let's skip that I love it to me it's ultra sexy okay ultra ultra sexy so don't listen to my boyfriend at least not always and of course um, Baccarat everybody loves it or hates it uh, I personally love it look how much I have already gone through this 200 ml, ml bottle uh, I did have the extra as you guys probably know it got stolen along with my handbag that you know it was inside it so it's a bummer uh, I will be repurchasing it for sure uh, I love them both they're both heavy hitters I would say this one projects better and the extra uh, lasts pretty much the same amount but you smell yourself more you know what I mean you just smell yourself more and people smell you too so you know you just choose what you want to choose I love them both it's very hard for me to tell you which one's better because I love them both but both heavy hitters this one is fantastic I would say it is actually quite worth it to get it in 200 ml over the 70 it is absolutely stunning I love it I love this fragrance maybe this will be my New Year's Eve scent so let's see let's see I am done I love you guys uh, I have two discounts for you in this video. First for Lily Silk, and I really suggest you take that chance now because this collection is so glorious. Like, look at those rhinestones, guys. You just have to have this blouse, at least this one, guys. Black or white doesn't matter. You have to have those rhinestones on your collar, okay? Um, and yes, get the discount code now before it's gone. And of course, you have discount code for Navitus. So if you want this Beauty Swell exclusive or any other from the Navitus brand, get yourself one before Christmas because it's going to be a perfect gift. And I might have the code expired by the new year so hurry up guys hurry up i love you nevertheless and see you tomorrow